Tonight's uh, Rav Moshe Feinstein's yard site and the Rav was very close to him. Can the Rav share a personal story about Rav Moshe Feinstein, maybe? He should have uh, told me from before to choose out something real good. <laughs> yeah, a personal story. Well, uh, well, my, my favorite, very short story, in the uh, one Shavuos, Halva Shavuos, he was came to our home uh, to spend some time on the on the Shavuos with us, and then actually all the boys from the yeshiva came over to the house also. And um, I said the story recently. Oh, I said it, I guess, in Lakewood. So uh, my oldest son at that time was a baby, and uh, he was in the playpen. Excuse me, playpen, oh, excuse me. Today, you don't play pens anymore. It's not, it's not good for kids. <laughs> Poor mothers, you so good at playpens. We're so good. The older generation, playpens, right? Used to have, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. today, today, you don't play pens anymore. <laughs> It'll, it'll come back in the style. You'll see. Pretty soon it'll come back again. You know, it'll come back. So everybody was uh, singing and happy, and, and he started to cry. He was crying. He's a little baby. I don't know why he's crying. So nobody paid pay too much attention. My wife was in the kitchen, you know, serving and taking care. And so I most time for him too. He's, he's a little baby, but he's yomtiv. It's holiday for him. You can't let him cry. Some to pick him up. Don't let him cry. So here we have this great uh, rabbi with everything on his mind, the whole Torah and the whole Jewish nation on his mind. And uh, he has so many things to uh, think about and to worry about and to uh, do about. But he was interested in the little baby also. It wasn't too above his uh, greatness to uh, be concerned about somebody else's baby crying. Because they, uh, they say, they say uh, a story that he was uh, uh, walking through in, in, in the hotel in the country. They were there in the, in the summertime. And uh, he was walking into, towards the dining room. And uh, he came, and all the women were inside eating. And they put, left the carriages outside the dining room for the babies. And one of them seemed to wake up and start crying. And all the kids started with the baby. He walked through. So he went and started shaking all the carriages. People, where is he? What happened? Where is he looking for him? Came out and saw he's trying to rock all the babies to get them to, to stop crying. So he's joking around. If you need a babysitter, ask Rabbi Weinstein. He's a great babysitter. <laughs> so see, some some things come to mind. That's pretty good. No, it's not bad. Who can I call? The